Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. So today's video is going to be a little different. I'm going to take you guys on a tour of my office slash studio. I'm going to show you guys behind the scenes where I do all my orders. So the first thing I'm going to do is show you guys a list of the orders I have to do. So I have three orders to complete. Okay, so I definitely need to work on the matte vellum envelopes for this, but I do have like the A6 binder. The scratch and save I definitely have to work on and the girl boss challenge. So if you guys don't know what the scratch and save is, I'm going to show you guys really quickly. This is the scratch and save book that I'll be creating for someone. And it has January through December in it. It is a folder with a scratch off in the front. So it has five scratch offs. You save for the month of January, so on and so on. So that is our monthly savings challenge scratch and save so I have to recreate this book this is mine that you guys usually see in the video and then also the girl boss challenge is available in my shop as well this girl boss challenge they did want a pink binder so I have to take that out the scratch and save is going to be the clear binder with pink and then the onyx binder is basically a black bind binder which is personalized. So these two will be personalized with the name. I didn't put the name on here just to keep, you know, people's name private, but I need two A6 of the Fox leather binders. And then this one is going to be the clear binder. So let's just take the binders out. I'm not going to physically be doing envelopes with you guys because yeah, it's just like a long process. If I was to put it on video, let's get the binders out and i'll show you guys a tour of my office okay so on the top of my shelf is the thank you stickers this is all packaging for items these are the a6 um envelopes that go into saving challenges and then this is like ink and stuff like miscellaneous stuff and then on the second shelf i have my a5 binder so i have them all standing up so they don't have lines on it and then also, this is available in my shop as well. These are color pencils and a nice cute container. So if you want to check those out, you can definitely check those out below. So these are all of my A5. And then as we go down, these are A7 and A6. So the A6 is in the back of it. They get a black onyx one. So I'm going to move these two. Hopefully they don't fall. And grab one of the black binders. Okay, so this is for the Onyx order right here. See, it keeps them nice and without lines. So I got one binder. And then I'm also going to grab a pink binder. So I'll move these items here. And pink is the one I have available the most of because a lot of people do like the pink A6 binders. So I'm just going to grab one of these here. Okay, so that's that. And then also below, I do have some binders. I have calculators. So if you guys haven't seen the calculators in my shop, I'm going to show you the one that I have available. It comes in all different colors. It's a nice chunky calculator. Um, and I love to use it like to count money and stuff like that. It's super, super cute. And the numbers are really big on it. So let me just turn it on for you guys really quickly. So there you go. Super cute. And I have it in different colors. So I'll show you guys the different colors that I have and again they're available at my shop so that was the pink one this is the green one right here i also have a blue one we have a purple one yes that's all the colors there um okay so i'm gonna grab one of these i have this in blue but i am gonna get a pink one this is for the scratch and save i like to work on orders on orders um really slowly just to get the envelopes perfect but they are handmade but i always try my best to make them perfect so i'm gonna get started on orders later um i'll try to get those out to you guys tomorrow and thank you guys for your orders i'm also this week i do owe you guys a cash stuffing video so i am gonna do that that i make for my business i cash stuff um for six months of expenses that's like the main goal so let's get into a tour of my studio slash office and let me, got, let me know down below, guys, like, what do you think of it? What should I change? 
Um, also, the flooring in here is really bad, so my husband has to work on the flooring. And hopefully in the future, like when things grow, I will grow and expand to my old studio somewhere. But this is basically an office and a studio in my home. So let's do a tour right now. Okay, so if we start off with this shelf right here, I'm going to try to keep the camera as sturdy as I can. These are all my laminating sheets. I have them all separate according to the milliliters. So I have matte and I have shiny on the top shelf. It's like shipping stuff, so I have tape. And this is all the papers I'll use, the vellum and stuff like that. Also, packaging is on the bottom. I have packaging somewhere else, but everything did not fit. If we go down to the third shelf, I just have some more packaging stuff. Also, the little papers that I use for the A6 binder, I have those there. And then on the third shelf is really everything that's available in my shop as far as stationery. Like most of it's on here. So I don't know if you guys have seen this on my website so we have the double edge highlighters this is a 15 count there is also a 20 count as well and then also i have these right here so these are the cute gel pens and they have the click thing on the top and i also have them available with just with just a cap so really cute right there and a lot of the savings challenge come with this pen right here so usually get inclu this included in your order okay as we move on this is so i have two desks i have this desk right here but i do want to expand this desk really long see how it cuts off there this is my old desk so i have to get one that's really long for my cricut as well because that's how i make the names in the binder so this is my computer here i have my label maker on here as well this is for shipping labels as well as my my logos that I make on these. Also, the freebie sticker is made with these with this machine right here. There goes my pink mat. So I wanted to get your guys' opinion. Do you guys like the cash stuffing videos with the pink mat setup or the white setup that I have now? So let me know down below which ones you guys like. I also have a printer here. And then we come here. This is the shelf that I showed you guys. Then I just have like miscellaneous stuff over here that needs to get hung up that as well. And then I have tissue thing there. I don't know where to put it at yet. Let's move on to my desk. Okay. So this is my desk setup. This is usually where I do videos at. I was just showing you guys the shelf there. So there goes my tripod right there. It's hooked up to my, um, desk. There goes my ring light that is really suffering. I need to get a new ring light but it will do for now. These are the three binders I have for orders, so I'm gonna work on that later. And then I have this here. This is all for business as well, so you guys who have done orders before, you usually get a thank you with your name on it, and it comes with a scratch off, so you can save next time. So it's like a mystery scratch off on your discount for next time. First drawer, I just have stuff that things go in. The second one, let me just move this right here. The second one is my logo sticker. Thank you stickers. And I believe I have freebies in here too. Yes. For every order I do add freebies and I add some good ones. These are the stickers that you guys get. That's also a freebie. And then at the end, this is a freebie as well. I added this new to the shop. So with every order, you do get a savings challenge. And it's a little small laminated one that's reusable. So it has a different denominations. You do get this free with your order as well. Okay, so if we move over to the side here. These are all my binders that I use in the videos. These are all my binders that I have in total. So you've guys seen these in the video, savings challenges, and I have two binders of one is six months of expenses and one is sinking funds. So if you are new to this channel, I can show you my sinking funds one has the ice cream collection envelopes in it so these are what these look like and then I have my business bills here so Shopify taxes Cricut and Canva and then this is how the binder comes personalized so this is my name so the name will be on the binder I have that binder and then this is my six months of expense binder the dashboards are available in my shop as well so we have all of these here, and then this is personalized in the back as well. So that's that. 
I have my 100 envelope that's available in my shop as well and it is personalized. I did show you guys the monthly scratch off challenge and yeah that's basically it and then all of my savings challenges are usually in here. So these are part of the girl boss challenges so you can choose like which one you want and then on the back of this I have Oh, and I added Christmas, so you'll see that in the next video. I have my dollar and my $5 diamond challenge. So those are all available in my shop as well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this studio vlog. I am going to work on orders now. And again, I will be having a cash stuffing video this week coming soon. I just need to go to the bank. And hopefully you enjoy this. What changes should I do in my office? I am working on getting a longer desk for my Cricut machine so everything could just be all in my office. Yeah, let me know what you guys think below. If you guys are interested in anything in the shop, my website is in the description box, also in the bio. So thank you guys for watching. I'll do these here and there when I'm making changes to the studio slash office. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.